How you doing everyone? I'm back. I know. Twice in one week. Uh, it's unheard of recently, but I thought I would just do probably a shorter video than I usually do. I've been waiting for so long to do these kind of vinyl updates that all my videos are 17 to 22 minutes long and I remember when I first started doing videos that my videos were quite short, around the 10 minute mark, so that's what we're going to aim for. We'll aim for about 10 minutes. Um, but I've got a few things through from Amazon that uh, I'm just going to show you. I may as well just uh, unbox and show you. So I've got three records. This is the box I get records in. This is the box I would get a record in whether it was three or one. Uh, hopefully they are individually packed as well inside but uh, I'll just crack this bad boy open. Um, I bought these yesterday. <clears throat> just all a really good price. I was looking through basically just general metal and uh, these three came up all under 13 quid so um, I thought I'd not heard two of them but I thought I'll just take the chance I'll just turn this around a little bit no, that was, um, I'll just take the chance and uh, see what they like because they were that cheap so as soon as I bought them, they were downloaded onto my Amazon Music account so I could listen to them before the records came, so I actually know what they all sound like. Um, well, one I knew before anyway. But I know the suspense is killing you. So let's get into this box. Here we go. So let's start with this one. Does it see on it? Yes, it does see on it. So this is one I hadn't heard new this year. Okay, I think I checked out the the single that was released. Um, it was okay, but this was I think around I want to say this was eleven pound, and uh, like I said, just released this year. I'm sure it was this year. Yeah, this year. Uh, Smith, Coatson. Uh, Adrian Smith and Richie Coatson. Obviously from Iron Maiden and... Uh, Richie Coatson from Mr. Big and Poison. Got kicked out of Poison for shagging Ricky Rocket's wife. So, yeah, this came up yesterday. Oh, this is embossed as well. Embossed cover. Uh, this came up yesterday for 11 quid. It had the uh, the black vinyl version and it had the black and red splatter version for 13 quid. But because I hadn't heard it, I'd only heard one song, I thought, there's n I know it's only two quid, but I thought I'll just get the black vinyl version. Um, inner with photo of the two of them. And black vinyl with custom labels. So... I have heard this once, I've not, um, I'll need to hear it a, a few more times obviously to let it sink in a bit, but I thought it was actually really good. Um, I've got Adrian Smith's solo album from, um, I don't know if it's late 80s or early 90s, but the ASAP album, uh, Silver and Gold, and that is really good. He does all the singing in that as well, and he does, um, him and Richie do share singing and guitar duties on this as well so um so first impressions it was it was good for 11 quid um i was picking this up all day every day um produced by those two and mixed by kevin shirley who you know from uh, iron maiden but yeah like i said first impressions i think it's really good it's bluesy it's hard rock, there is some metal in there as well, not a lot of metal, but it's mostly hard rock, but um, I think it's well worth a pick up for 11 quid, so there we go, Smith Cotson, um, ah, yeah, self-titled, so that's the first one, next one up is, so 
something or two ill packs. I think this is also released this year. Which I'm surprised at because these prices are awesome. Yeah, it is released this year on Metal Blade. Um, Artillery and 10 or X, however you'd want to uh, pronounce that. Again, came up. This is about this is about 12 quid on Amazon. So I thought I would just uh, jump on it. And the thing is, I haven't heard a lot of artillery from the 80s, 90s or whatever. I've heard bits and pieces, maybe the first song on a couple of the albums, but I've never really sat and kind of delved into them properly. So I got the download through for this yesterday. Um, and I listened to it, I thought it was brilliant. Um, obviously picking it up because it was cheap, uh, I just thought I'd take a chance, but I listened to it through and I was really impressed. Um, and finally. So like I said, released this year. There we go, it's a better view of the cover. And you've got a mix of speed metal in there, you've obviously got the thrash, um, just straight up heavy metal as well. It's, it, I would say it's mostly traditional metal, um, but there's some cracking songs on this. The Force of Indifference, um, I'm going to absolutely butcher this, Moore's Ontologica, Moore's Ontologica is a great song as well, and Thrash We Trust. Turn Up The Rage, Silver Cross, um, some great tracks in this, honestly it's it's not really got a bad song on it, um, which I wasn't expecting because it was so cheap and it has just been released, but um, I was uh, pleasantly surprised. Metal Blade, Black Vinyl, Custom Labels. And the uh, card inner with lyrics as well. So I would actually recommend you go out and get this. And a download card. So if anybody wants this, I don't um I don't use these, so first one can use that. If you can get a good view of that. There we go. Um, I don't even know what I was saying there. Yeah, pleasantly surprised. It's definitely going to make me go out and try more artillery in full album form. Um, I don't think you'll be disappointed if you're into, obviously, traditional metal, thrash, speed metal, which I'm pretty sure you are if you're watching my channel. Um, I think you'll be pleasantly surprised with this. Um, and it's cheap. So grab it all you can at that price. So that's artillery and ten. So that's two releases this year I got for under twenty five quid. And the last one. This is the one I have heard before. Um, I've never owned a copy of this on CD or cassette or vinyl. Um, this has always been pretty cheap on Amazon. I've just never really grabbed it because I thought it's always been cheap. I'll just grab it. Um, whenever really, but I was on uh, I was on yesterday and I thought, you know what, this is now the time to grab this. Um, SOD, Stormtroopers of Death, Speak English or Die. I'm trying to remember when this first came out. I want to see it's nine eighty five maybe. I maybe go maybe say eighty five, but. Um, if you don't know SOD, it's Billy Milano from MOD, Methods of Destruction. You've got Scott Ian from Anthrax. You've got Charlie Benanti from Anthrax. And Dan Lauker, ex-Anthrax and Nuclear Assault. And this is phenomenal. It's a, it's a tongue-in-cheek album. But that's, that doesn't take away from the music. The music's awesome. This is not working. Um... It is. It's, it's different from. It's not. It's not Anthrax. It's. Um, it's. I think it's heavier. 
than anthrax. It's better than anthrax. Um, right, there we go. Double LP set. So you do have on side A. Oh yeah. So side A and side B are oh, the album. I was totally confused there. Um, then you've also got bonus studio tracks and side C and side D. Um, sorry, side C is live, all your live stuff. And in fact, say do use a live stuff as well. Actually, know what you're talking about. <clears throat> Inside lyrics collage. So this was also twelve quid. Oh, nice! I didn't know this either. And it comes on a gold and grey and well, we'll call it a camo sort of splatter, but. That's a big surprise, I didn't know that was coming in a colour variant, so um, as you can see, custom label. But yeah, you got to check, if you've not checked out SOD, you've got to check out SOD. Um, like I say, tongue in cheek, the songs like um, uh, Jesus, I am so bad at this on camera. Um, kill Yourself. Um, the Milano Mosh, Speak English or Die, obviously. Sergeant D and the SOD. Um, Anti-procrastination song, which lasts about 20 seconds. Uh, What's That Noise is a, is a, is a daft song. Uh, Freddy Krueger, March of the SOD. It's a, it's a really good, fun album, and it's got some great riffs in there as well. So, all around... Superb and a double album for 12 quid. You can't really argue with that. So there we go. I think this is the reissue from 2005. No, can't be that. Surely. It's the reissue anyway. So SOD, Stormtroopers of Death, Speak English or Die. Um, if you've not checked it out, check it out. It's awesome. So there we go, that's the three pickups. 12 minutes isn't bad for three records, two brand new ones. Get them cheap on Amazon while you can. And SOD, get it cheap on Amazon while you can. So until the next time, I'll see you guys later.